hey guys welcome back to maxi's kitchen or welcome if this is your first time here today we're making beer buttered chicken nuggets now you can use the same butter for fish and have it with chips and you can use it for so many other things but i just want to make chicken today so stay tuned don't go anywhere So here's a list of all the ingredients you need to make this recipe. Now we're going to start with the butter. So we're making the dry ingredients, um, the dry mixture for the butter. Now you want to make sure that everything related to the butter is very cold. And that's why we're making this first. So we'll mix everything up and then keep it in the fridge. to the chicken I use chicken thigh fillets because I think they are more flavorful they have um, fats attached to the chicken unlike the chicken breast which adds to the flavor but you can use chicken breast if you don't have chicken thigh fillets or if you don't want to use it okay so now I'm going to grind my chicken and I used this ninja mini shopper to actually do it and it did the job very very well if you have it please use it if you have a food processor, it would do the job very well too. You can use a blender, I think, but just make sure that whatever you are using is giving you a finely, um, it's giving you a nice texture, okay? So you want it to be finely grounded like this. to the seasoning of the chicken you can just use salt and black pepper to be honest but I just wanted to you know give my chicken nuggets a different taste from what you would usually get from supermarkets and all of those places so I added in some chili powder chili flakes and a bit of garlic powder I think but that's totally optional you can just stick to the normal salt and pepper Okay guys, please when it comes to the molding of the chicken nuggets, don't be too precise, don't try and get all of them to be the same shape, the same size. Guys, variety is the spice of life. Honestly, you don't need to be a perfectionist all the time. Make some smaller, make some bigger, make some into like perfect circles and just make some into different irregular shapes and they would look very very nice. And at this point, so these are very delicate, so you want to put them in the freezer um, just the way they are on the tray for about 10 minutes at least so that they are able to hold their shape and don't like get deformed easily. And then you want to put some cornstarch into a plate like I've done and we're going to coat each nugget with the cornstarch or potato starch very very lightly you don't want to give them a very thick coating so very lightly and then you want to dust the excess corn starch or pota potato starch off and then put it on a board or another tray <music> so 
So I'm done with those and I'm going to set that aside and get our dry mixture for the butter from the fridge. Remember that we put it in the fridge and you don't want to take it out until you need to make the butter. Okay, let's talk about the beer. Now I used Heineken because Heineken has a very, it has a lot of gas. I know that all beers have a lot of um, gas, they're all carbonated, but some have more gas than some. And I think Heineken is a very, um, typical example of the one that has a lot of gas so I'd recommend that you use it or find one just like Hennekin which has very high um, uh, gas content now I didn't give you an exact measurement to follow for the beer I just want you to freestyle it just pour and pour until you get the texture that I got you don't want it to be too light or too heavy okay so once you're done just take your chicken again dip it in the butter and then fry in your hot oil you can fry it for some time take it out and then second fry again so you can fry it twice now the good thing about this recipe is that once you're actually done frying it if you can't eat everything you can actually keep it in the fridge just like this and the next day you can actually refry it and you would you would get the same exact texture if you don't want to fry it again you can actually just put it in the oven too for some time and you'll get this texture so i can't wait for you guys to try it i hope you love it when you do and let me know um how it goes when you try it please don't forget to subscribe and comment below let me know what else you want to see on this channel love you guys bye